530 Metro police are searching for a hit and run driver who left 23 year old Jordan Offit critically injured in a ditch. The crash occurred on the west side at the intersection of Eagle Creek Parkway and Eagle Bay North Drive. RTV 6's Derek Thomas reports police want the suspect to turn himself in, but if he doesn't, they are coming after him. The victim was jogging with her father. She was struck over there by that light pole. She was hit so hard that she flew all the way over here and was found in this ditch. My neighbor seen the girl flying through the air and... It, what a shame. It, yeah, it's terrible. I don't know what we can do about these drunks driving, but... You, some, you, you, something suspect, more. you suspect it was drunk? Had to be. We now know that the victim is 23-year-old Jordan Offit. She is still listed in critical condition in the hospital. The driver of a 2006 Gray Ford did not stop after he struck the victim. Police recovered the vehicle at about 11 p.m. last night in the 5300 block of Holly Springs Drive. Police say the driver's behavior is unacceptable. This individual uh, couldn't say uh, that they, 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 they didn't know that they were in an accident. The tire was flat, there was heavy front end damage, the, the vehicle was leaking fluids, and then to abandon that vehicle, uh, run or have another method of, of, of eluding law enforcement is another issue. Police want the driver of the hit and run vehicle to turn himself in. Now, if you have any information about that, please call police at 262 TIPS. Derek Thomas. RTV6. And one of the witnesses we talked to, as you heard, believed that alcohol was involved in the crash, but police cannot confirm that.